What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about season 4 of The Mandalorian. But before we do get into all of that, remember hit the subscribe, like, and notification bell so you're always in the know on everything Star Wars. Don't forget I have a membership program that I just did an update to so make sure to join one of them as the tiers are simply amazing and I've updated them so definitely go check them out so you get to get behind the scene footage and go live with me on my daily content. Go check out the merch store as I do have Eternal Sith merch that you definitely want to go check out and as always once you're done watching this video Go check out my last one. Give it a thumbs up as you watch. Let's start the show. Welcome to the show with the eternal self. Every visit banger, best believe he don't mess. Do me a favor, drop us up and keep tuning in. If you like what you see, go and share with your friends. As there has been a lot of rumors as to who this character is of, yes, none other than Marek. Now we can finally lay to rest as it's been confirmed that this new Inquisitor was in service of the Empire before becoming a mercenary after its fall. Now this debunks like I said the brutal theory suggesting that this new foe could be Jedi Knight Ezra Bridger. Now having been corrupted to the dark side during his disappearance into the unknown regions after the series finale of Star Wars Rebels season 4 and now wearing a fallen inquisitor's armor instead this profile confirms that this new villain is a bona fide imperial inquisitor who served the empire. Now the debunking of evil Ezra theory at least in this form should come as a relief. Hopefully Ezra will be found by Ahsoka and their fellow rebel friends having been gone for years after he defeated Grand Admiral Thrawn by sending them into the unknown regions. Now with Thrawn set to make his return to the galaxy as heir to the Empire, the hope is that Ezra will be returning as well. However, there are still plenty of exciting question marks regarding the upcoming Star Wars series. Now, while Marek is a new name, it could imply a codename hiding the Star Wars character to hide a major reveal, just as we got to see in the Mandalorian Season 2 finale when instead of being, you know, uh, it was supposed to be Plo Koon, it ended up being Luke Skywalker, but they used Plo Koon as a cover-up. And one of the most prevalent Inquisitor theories, I would have to say, that has stuck other than obviously Starkiller, but again, I'm not going to go with Starkiller because he's just too much of an OP character. I will say is it would have to be Barriss Offee, Ahsoka's former Jedi friend during the Clone Wars, who was corrupted by the dark side and saw through the lies of the Jedi and subsequently framed Tano for a bombing at the Jedi Temple. Now, although Ahsoka cleared her name and Offee was arrested, her final fate was never really revealed, making a potential Inquisitor reveal quite compelling. That said, Mara could simply be a new character for the Ahsoka series, as we know Star Wars overall has changed the canon up so much since the original trilogy and everything that we've gotten, especially since obviously Disney has acquired Lucasfilm. We have gotten a lot more content such as Cal Kestis and more, but I will have to say this guys, when it goes back to Ezra returning, things could still be different as he's been gone for quite some time and like I talked about in my video yesterday, there could be a greater threat in the unknown regions that he has been helping Thrawn going against the Gris. but at least now we know we can lay to rest that it is not Ezra that is that Inquisitor in the shot or in the scene that we do see in the trailer when Ahsoka is going up against this unknown Inquisitor that did serve during the Empire. But the biggest question is who is this character? Again, there are a lot of theories, a lot of speculation, but my guess is as good as yours. And my theory is, or my assumption is going to be Barris Alfie. And I'm going to stick to that till the very end. Till once we see this character get revealed in the Ahsoka series, but comment down below guys, after hearing this news that this Inquisitor did serve during the Empire and it's no longer, you know, theorizing that it could be Ezra. What are your thoughts as to who this Inquisitor can be? Light it up in the comment section down below. For more Star Wars content, hit that subscribe, like, and notification bell so you're always in the know as I'll have more content out tomorrow. Don't forget, I have a membership program. Definitely you want to join. There's three tiers. I just updated them, and I will be going live behind the scenes, so make sure to join the membership program so you can check on the community post for members only, the live stream link for that, and I will be talking about everything Star Wars in more in-depth details. Thank you so much for tuning in, guys. Don't forget the Eternal Sith, then, now, forever. Later, guys.